celebration one. Oh my god! The next video you'll get is the week of guests! That is so exciting. This is the last one before the week of guests starts. Oh my gosh, the best. <laughs> Welcome back to Ever Disney Movie Ever. My name is Justin. I'm watching Ever Disney Movie Ever. Today, I'm going to talk about Arjun the Warrior Prince. Arjun the Warrior Prince is a 2012 Indian animated release about a boy named Arjun who becomes a warrior and protects his family. It is directed by Arnab Chanduri, Pavan Baragoen, and KK Reina. Cinematography by Hemant Chattarvedi. Creative director Pankaj Kandpur. Editor uh, Asrikar Prasad. Music by Vishal Dadlani, Dhruv Kanekar, and Shikhar Ravjiani. Written by Rajesh Devraj and R.D. Tailang. Uh, the film stars Yudhvir Bak Bakalia as Arjun, Ashok Banthia as uh, Beam, Ravi Kanvilkar as Drona, Vijay Kashyap as Shakuni. Ilya Aran as Kunti and uh, Sashin Kadekar as Krishna. The animation was done at Tata Elksi. Animators were super excited to tackle this story and try and tell it in an animated fashion. The actors performed together like in a play instead of alone in a booth and the director was super proud of the action sequences. It does have a 67% on Rotten Tomatoes but there's no consensus and it did have an announced sequel that ended up getting canceled. I thought the animation was so fun. I thought the style was really cool. I was excited to kind of watch this movie in this animation style. There was a minute there where I didn't think I'd find a copy with subtitles. Shout out Max for finding me a copy of this with subtitles. <laughs> uh, but it was, it was beautiful. Uh, it just in certain moments was a little bit clunky, which is kind of to be expected. It was, however, way better than Roadside Romeo's animation. Roadside Romeo's animation was a little bit creepy to look at. Then again, that was very 3D computer generated. This looked a little bit more hand-drawn. I don't know if it was hand-drawn, but it was like 2D hand-drawn type look, uh, but it was very beautiful. The music was fabulous. I feel like as usual for these, I had a fun time. I thought the different musical breaks were great. The plot for this is a mess. I don't, some of the reason, okay. Basically, Arjun and his family have a right to the throne, and then the other side of the family has a right to the throne, and they're really threatened by Arjun's side of the family, so they keep trying to do all these things to, like, send them away and give them their own little place, or kill them, or whatever, and so they're on the run a lot, and then they end up, like, partnering with another kingdom, so then they have, like, a lot of armies, so then they're gonna be given the kingdom, and, uh, they're given a kingdom and then they build it up and they make such a beautiful peaceful loving kingdom and then the brother that is being the king of that kingdom bets everything he has to them in this stupid game that they're obviously tricked or rigged or winning at and bets his whole kingdom bets his family it's absolutely i don't understand that scene i don't understand why the the brother was doing that it was so stupid I genuinely was like, what is going on? Why is he doing this? Do I not understand the rules of the game? I must not understand the rules of the game. So that made me so mad because then they're exiled for 12 years and uh, for a 13th year, they have to live in a complete exile where you're, if you're even spotted, it's another 12 year ban. And it's just insane just to push the story to where it needs to be. Also, the times, they're all so short and there's this, that, and the other. And then out of nowhere, Arjun, who was like kind of scared of combat, is beheading people left and right like it's nothing. It was just so all over the place. It is beautiful. It is fun to like follow Arjun. It's interesting to see another culture story of a like, I think it's like a classic story because they were excited to tackle it. Uh, so it's like really cool to see from that standpoint and everything and just be able to watch it for an animated film. Uh, not that I have it before. Hello, Studio Ghibli. Hello. Triple to Belleville, <laughs> um, you know, still, but like to see this and the, he just bets his cane away and there's just like so much beheading all of a sudden when he went, it, it was a little bit messy. It was a little bit not great. 
My favorite part is when Arjun shoots the fish from under the water using the shadow. I thought that was really clever, really cool. My least favorite part is when Arjun shoots an elephant. Unforgivable, absolutely not. Recommend, I suppose. This is kind of cool, it's kind of cool to experience. Watch again, I don't think so. I don't think I'll be watching it again. Specific moments, fish, elephant, um, confusing reason for the 13 year exile. Very stupid, don't understand that. This was a wild ride, okay? Arjun disguising. Oh, that's the other thing. Basically, this is framed as a woman telling a story to a, uh, like a teen boy who like, wants to be a warrior. And she's telling it to him, like this great story of Arjun the warrior. The girl telling the story is Arjun. He's dressed up as a girl. So Arjun is telling this story about the great warrior Arjun himself. And he hasn't even finished being a great warrior. So then it's like weird and tacky and yucky that he's telling a story about himself. So I hated that too. <laughs> That's it. That's everything I have for Arjun the Warrior Prince. It's fun. Go watch it. It was just, I was so like, what is happening? My final rating is six... bow and arrows out of 10. Our total movie count is... As far as I know, they don't say anything about the parents, so parents, that's all, and cry counters are the same. If you want to keep up with movie and watching when, follow me on all socials, find out what movie I'm watching when I put up videos every Monday and Friday and sometimes Wednesday, join Patreon. Tears turning at just $1, you get everybody a week early coupon commercial exclusive merch access, but it's celebration month, so the $1 tier does get daily trivia access. So for $1 for the whole month of August, you could be getting daily trivia. So go on, go on now, get. Buy merch, merch is grand, merch is grand. This is the OG guys. Mm. Until next time, come on and subscribe but I'm not in charge of your life, you are so you, and don't be the uh, one guy about it who's absolutely hor horrific. I don't remember his name. Yo, week of guests, week of guests. How exciting week of guests, week of guests.